Hello guys, welcome back in another video. Today we're gonna talk about batteries. So this video is not a paid promotion. I pay f the full price of this battery and I decide to upgrade it from a standard battery to a lithium battery and I save around uh, three kilo on a bike. Three kilo is uh, quite a lot and uh, if you consider how much I spend on money for saving three kilos it's not that much so this there are two type of battery three type of battery one that I don't remember the name brand one is the JMT and the last one is the Skyreach so in order to install the battery on this bike uh, what you have to do is to find the correct one and the code for the Honda Transalp 600 is this one. So uh, what are the things that matter on the bike, uh, on the battery? The pole, the negative and the positive pole have to be on the right position. So I saw some people uh, installing a smaller one with this code but is a battery for a scooter is uh, strong enough to start up the bike but is not the right one to last it longer the lithium battery are better not only for the weight but also for the power so it start up much better especially in winter and is supposed to last longer some people say that it is not possible if you forget the key lock on it's not possible to uh, recharge it but actually it's possible and there are specific uh, battery charger for lithium uh, batteries the only thing that i have to say is if you uh, make the, uh, the battery flat so you put under zero based on some experience uh, you are, it's not possible to recharge it again so you have to be careful when you turn on the bike my suggestion is just take off the key when you leave the bike somewhere and uh, you will not forget the dashboard on so what we are waiting, let's go to install it and check it, the weight. So this one is the battery. Inside you have the nuts, the spacer. And this one, as you can see, if you push this button, you can see if it's charged or not. As I said before, you can put like this or reverse it like this so no problem when you install it compared to the standard one the size doesn't change but the only thing that change is the weight and the power of course the price is uh, more than double but the sky reach it cost 155 euro so now we are going to install it let's go so i already removed the nuts here so i just uh, remove the okay and the one on the back so it make easier to install i unscrew this one okay and i take the battery so since i can't reach this height which is ideal for the battery i'm gonna put the spacer under the battery and i'm gonna stick on the battery because the surface is clean so i put uh, the two spacer under the battery the positive is on the left side and the negative is on the right side so now it's time to close to tight up the screw the nuts 
OK. Probably I'm gonna put a spacer on the top over here. So finally, I installed it. I put one spacer on the top. I turn it on. And I try to start. Wow. That's amazing. Consider the bike was cold. I turn it off. I turn it on and uh, just push. Amazing. I don't lie about the weight of the battery. So I, I took a scale and now you can see the weight. Over here, it's say uh, around 3.9 kilo, almost 4 kilo. And the difference with the lithium battery is 3 kilo. The weight of the lithium one is 900 grams. So the advantage in the end are cold start, start better. Second one is the weight three kilo safe on the bike. And last one are the better start during your ride off-road. So I think you start quite, start quite, quite often when you ride off-road because maybe you have an uphill or you just crash. So if you need to start many times, you stress a lot. On the meanwhile, this one, even you stress a lot, it starts always on the same way. I need to test it for a year at the least to give you a good feedback on it. And uh, well, I will let you know after a few thousand kilometer. Actually, Fabio tested already a couple of years and he's uh, really satisfied. So guys, if you like the video, thumbs up. Leave a comment if you want to know something more or if you want to suggest something for the next video. What else? Subscribe to the channel and see you on the next video. Ciao!